What's going on guys, Supergirl Zombie back again with another video and in this one I want to be doing an unboxing of the War for the Planet of the Apes 4K Steelbook from HMV. Um, as you saw in my last video, uh, we just went through the pile and I pulled this one out of the bottom. Um, I did say in that video I'll be doing a separate video on it, so this is that video. So let me just show you what it is here. So I for 25 quid you get this really cool... 4K, it comes with uh, the 4K edition, the 3D, the Blu-ray, and I think it's the bonus disc. I could be wrong. Let me just let me take the sticker off quickly. Um, I did not see this film in cinema at the time, because I think there was someone else out. I can't remember what, but I chose to go watch that. And I've been dying to see this film. Ever since, because I love the new trilogy. That was like that old one with like Mark Wahlberg. Didn't really like it. I loved Rise of the Planet of the Apes. That's my favorite one. Um, sorry if you can, there's a noise in the background. This, uh, the cats are running around. Um, loved Rise of the Planet of the Apes. I thought that film was amazing. I liked Dawn of the Planet of the Apes. Didn't think it was the best, but it was good. It wasn't bad. I, I've only watched it only a couple of times, so if I watch it now, I'll probably change what opinion on it. So, oh, this comes with the digital as well. So, as you can see, apparently this one's a great ending to the trilogy. Um, really sad, great action, great story. Andy Serkis does another, apparently. I mean, he never does any wrong performances. I know he's all CGI in this, but still, that's even incredible. Exciting and impressive. 4K. Uh, so let's get into this one. This one's still got the security protection on it. I was trying to, uh, when I was there, because I've already got the Spider Man Homecoming one, and I've got the Alien Covenant, which I'll be doing another video on. Um, don't know when I'll put that one up. There was this and the Kingsman, the second Kingsman. I haven't seen... I saw the first one, but it was a long time ago. So before... Damn it, this is really tough to get into. So, uh... Before I even think about buying the steelbook for the, uh... Second Kingsman, I'm going to buy the first one and rewatch that first. Just to see if I like it still. Hang on a minute, just give me a second, guys. Sorry about this. I'm just going to have to cut this one open. Uh... Yeah, there we go. Go on to it now. Right. Think so. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I love new. I love getting new steel books. If I can get a steel book, I definitely will. So, as you can see, it's uh, it's not like one of those shiny steel books. It's got a nice shiny color here, but um, it's like matte. You know how matte black is. That that material. It's like this. Um, as you can see, it's got the cardboard on the side, which is really cool. The Spider Homecoming one was really annoying. It had this flimsy thing that came over the top. I took that off and put it in the drawer. But this one, like Alien Isolation, uh, Alien Covenant, comes out like this. And you've got the awesome... It's I love this. I, lo um, I do like really cool, detailed like artworks on steelbooks. Um, anyway, let me just grab a few. Like, like Spider-Man, for example. You've got a really, really look shiny, so it comes with fingerprints. I mean, I do wipe it down there and then. Really, really detailed steel books. But then you get, I really like the plain, where it's just a couple of colours. This is a really nice plain one. Sees on a horse. Nice white. And then on the back, the symbol of some kind. I haven't seen the movie, so I don't know what that's about. So, as we open up into the film you get Rise of the Planet of the Apes let me just check oh that's cool you get a code for that one Dawn of the Planet of the Apes 
So I'm technically getting all of the movies on digital codes, except I don't watch digital, which sucks. Dawn of the Planet of the Apes there. Uh, right, uh, War for the Planet of the Apes. So you get the free. Free codes, which I think is pretty cool. And then as you can see here, you've got the free discs. You've got the 3D Blu-ray. And then here you've got the normal Blu-ray. You've got a nice picture of Caesar there. Um, and then you've got the Ultra HD 4K copy with some more gorillas on the back. So I think that's a really cool case, in my opinion. So there it is. That's the uh, Wolf of Planet of the Apes 4K. Still, but I know this is a very short video, and I'm not, I'm really tired, so that's why I'm probably not talking as much. Um, yeah, that I, I think that's an, I think that's an incredible deal for 25 quid. You get three different, actually, what you get one, two, three, uh, two, three movies, but you get one, two, three, four, four different versions of the third movie. That's incredible. I think that's amazing. Um, so, yeah, that's, there it is, that's the War for the Planet of the Apes, Steelbook, 4K, I, I'm going to give that one, that's a, actually I can't even review this one to be honest, I haven't seen the film, so, uh, I think that's a great Steelbook, not my favourite, this one's my favourite, let me just give you a quick tease of the uh, Alien Covenant Steelbook. That's the Alien Covenant. So, um, yeah. And I've got an Avengers one, which I'll do a, another video on. Anyway, that's my uh, War for the Planet of the Apes 4K Steelbook. Hope you guys enjoyed that one, and I'll uh, see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye.